zero corruption, country, and freedom. Talking about our fears, our continued fears, one can see that the seed of fears have been sown some years ago, probably immediately after the Civil War ended. That brings me to the question of the abundant property, the so-called abundant property. What's your take on this? My dear brother, abundant property is very, very unfortunate. It ought not to have happened in the first place. There was no need for anybody to have taken the property of the U.S. And we have to do restitution and we have to apologize to them. Uh, people just lie. You can tell a lie, but one day the truth will come. You can continue to lie every day you lie the, the truth. I tell you, the Igbos went to ACB, which belonged to all of us, and collected money and built the houses. Uh, they don't have paper to the land. None of them have papers. Uh, this one, that one, yes. We took the property. We go to Portaco today. 90% of those abandoned properties have been returned to the Igbos. They bought it back. We took from them, they bought it back. 70% of the total real estate in Port Harcourt are owned by the Hebrews today. 70%. Go to the market. Over 90% of the shades which rivers people collect are occupied by Hebrews. All the lock-up stores in Oguna Valley, everywhere, are occupied by the Hebrews. Did they also use a spiritual APC, a a a ACB, to come and collect this thing? Go to... Uh, your central market. Ninety percent of the shares are not Igbo people shares. Yeah. Yeah, go to correct uh, one. Uh, are they not Igbo people shares? Yeah. Go to Calabar what market. Are they not Igbo people shares? Yeah. We come to Inekwa. I just we just went to buy something at General Supermarket. He's owned by an Igbo man. The people selling their Igbos. Did they use a, a, a SCB to collect it? So what, why are we lying? They said that uh, the evils killed our people. I don't know the family structure in the Bible now. But I know that in Calabari we have work in new houses. My father, my father's father, mother, where he come, where he come, you there, is from the young Judge Gilead family, the Akabo, Barango, Gooded House, Ari. So if somebody sees me on the road and I introduce myself, Melford, talk about good dead. The first thing the person will say, which good dead are you? I say, yeah, I'm a Melford's son. Which Melford? I said, Melford, the son of Doc. Oh, Doc, what the postmaster? The son of you there, a member of Akabo's house. It's very easy. So where are the people that were killed in Agonima? Who are they? Are they the Chibo girl? Are they go? Because if, if you now say and kill up wrong breeds, everybody knows who and kill up who up wrong is. It's not needing something to find somebody in Calabar. But they keep on telling this lie. They cannot tell us the people that were killed in Bukma the, by Biafra, the people that were killed in Abuma by Biafra, the people that were killed in Pakana by Biafra. Don't they have family? If I go to Biafra like this, if I go to Bakana like this, I stand like this. I say I'm going to Shalibolo. Charlie, a bangbo will break compound. A bangbo, uh, the son of Komagolia. Komagolia, the son of Odum Baiboy. Odum, Odum, uh, Odum Baiboy, the son of Awu. So, who are you going to see?